bicycle. What are you doing here? You got real issues, Steve. Where'd you find me? How is that even important right now? Important to me. Who cares? I'm here and we got issues. Stop leaning. Leaning? On the car, you're leaning on the car. Oh, Christ, Steve. Listen to me. We need to talk about France. What about it? Words out. Talk's all over town, and it's not good. Not my problem anymore. I'm done. Yeah, maybe when your name is Joe Schmo from Button Willow, not when your name is Steve fucking McQueen. Cinema Center reps are not happy, Steve. So what's the brass tax? They want you to do press. No. Steve. Look, the point was to make a good film, a real film. People like a story, Steve. They like characters. You were shooting a two-hour documentary about a car race that no one in America cares about. We well, had made them care. The suits thought different. I'm done with it. Fine. I'll go back to Rosa with that. But it's not going to go down too well. And it still doesn't change where we are now. We have to do some damage control. Damage control? Bill called me. Ah, son of a bitch. We're your team, Steve, all right? If we don't communicate, this doesn't work. We're not the enemy. Just let us do our job. It's time to go to work. You need to choose your next picture carefully. I'm doing on any Sunday with Bruce. The motorcycle thing? No, that's a vacation. You need a paycheck. I might have some endorsements lined up, strictly overseas. But our top priority has to be your next gig. Something that puts you back on top. Have you thought about what I said about first artists? Just join the club, huh? Yeah, it's a good deal. And Newman, what's he doing? For first artists, pocket money. Come on, you're already attached to the pick of the litter already. Junior Bonner, the getaway, that French prison thing. Just pick. Uh, just pick, huh? Yeah. Just pick. Yes, Steve, pick, for Christ's sake. I came all the way out to Bumblefuck here to tell you things are bad. You hammered your money and you burned every goddamn bridge back in France. You know what's really chopping my hide, Freddy? This car. Who cares? They come and go with you, Steve. Yeah, Warner Brothers gave it to me. A gift. It's a beauty. Yeah, there's just one problem. What's the problem, Hank? Not the car. Not the car. What car? The car. Look, this is a pacifier, it, it, an imposter. The car was the 1968 GT390. 325 horsepower, 427 foot-pounds of torque, a real power plant. Had a four-speed manual transmission, too. What else, Hank? Dark Highland Green. Dark Highland Green. Who cares? <laughs> Are you blind? Listen, this is a 67 302 Boss prototype. It's no GT390. And it's a fucking automatic. Find me the car, Freddy. Look, we don't have time for this, Steve. It's all set, Steve. Thanks, buddy. That's it. You find me the car, I'll pick my next project. Look, that's gonna be impossible. I need it, Freddy. Blink if it's a yes. Good. Send down how to do it. You're a stand-up guy, Freddy. I'll call to check in. A two-hour documentary about a car race that nobody in America cares about? Their words. You seen Katzen's cut? Most of John's stuff is out. Too bad. Be reasonable, Steve. Freddy, I hired you to be a barracuda. Are you a barracuda? I'm a barracuda. Right. Find the car. Adios. I took a goddamn cab here!